Hi everybody! I hope you're doing well and staying safe. My name is Ariana and as the current president of the club, I am here to give a huge big warm welcome to all of our amazing new NHS members. I wish I could be congratulating you guys in person right now, but regardless of the circumstances, I want you to know that I am super proud and super excited for every one of you guys. I hope you guys are super excited as well. I think that during times like these, it's definitely a good idea to remember all the positive things that are going on in your life right now. So just remember that you worked super hard to be here and so you should be super proud of yourself. Being in NHS is a great honor and accomplishment to have. You guys probably have an idea of this by now, but what NHS is, is a club that is dedicated to recognizing and encouraging outstanding students just like yourselves. Uh, being in NHS shows that you are not only thriving in academics, but you're also thriving in leadership, character, and service. So I want to say once again, congratulations on your membership and welcome into the club! Hello uh, new NHS inductees, we are so happy to have you. NHS is an amazing club and you guys will all enjoy it. So I'm here to explain a little bit what uh, meetings look like. So meetings are about once a month. Uh, we go over standard processing, uh, voting for minutes, talking about uh, the procedure and the requirements to stay in the club and not be on, put on probation, which is quite easy and about reaching our minimum requirement of hours. Uh, we talk about all types of uh, services that we can get into and that's anything from Feed My Starving Children about three times a semester and then we also have the option of tutoring, online tutoring, all those options. We have so many service opportunities. It's an amazing club. You'll have so much fun with it. Thank you guys. I'm so excited for you guys to join. Hi guys, my name is Emily Jurette and I'm the current treasurer of NHS. We're all so excited and proud of you for your acceptance into this amazing organization. You all have worked so hard to get here and I'm so sorry that you guys can't have the proper induction ceremony that you deserve. You were accepted into this fantastic organization on the basis that you exhibited all four of NHS's pillars. These pillars are scholarship, leadership, service, and character. Scholarship is a commitment to learning and dedication to academic achievement. It means dedicating the necessary time that it takes to fully acquire knowledge and apply it accurately and wisely in your daily life. It means always doing the best work possible regardless of any impending reward. I want to thank you all and wish you the best during this crazy time of uncertainty. I know you will do great things with the rest of high school. Make the most of it. The National Honor Society has recognized you for your outstanding leadership qualities, academic achievement, citizenship, and overall contribution to Campo Verde High School. Being a member of NHS is the highest honor a student can earn through demonstrating responsibility and an obligation to serve the community. You are the new leaders of Campo Verde, called to encourage service to the people around us. As a member of NHS, it is your responsibility to acquire the skills to be a great leader. Leadership plays a significant role in the foundation of this club. Your responsibility and commitment to the club will not go unnoticed as you develop the skills to become a true leader. We are excited to welcome you to the National Honor Society and can't wait to see how you take on the role as a scholarly student. Hi, my name is Maradi Pham and I'm your NHS historian for this chapter. The important pillar of NHS is called service. And what exactly is service? Service is when you give back to your community by volunteering your time and dedicating your effort to aid others while bringing the community together. So what service projects have we done here in NHS? We have spent countless hours at Feed My Serving Children as well as tutoring our Campo family. An important one this year we have done is dedicating pounds of food as well as time to make blankets and toys to dog shelters across the valley. Another one we have done this year is made ribbons for a Gilbert student that has passed away in our community. Not to mention the 15 or more hours that each student has provided to enhance this club, bring the community together, and help others. We wish you all a safe and healthy quarantine, and I hope we get to see you guys soon. Thank guys, you. My name is Isabella Millar, and I'm the junior representative of National Honor Society. And the fourth pillar of National Honor Society is character. Character seems kind of like a vague word. Like, if I were to hear it two years ago, I'd be like, what does that even mean? And basically, it's what you're doing when no one else is around. It's how you act, how you think. It's basically defined by who you are as a person. If you're like showing respect, 
having integrity, those are all things that build your character. And that's the kind of thing that NHS is looking for in a student.